Now this relationship we just saw, where pH is the exponent of the concentration, just without the negative sign, that actually has a real formula, a more technical definition we can use. And that's the pH is equal to the negative log of the hydrogen ion concentration. And pOH is equal to the negative log of the hydroxide concentration. So what the heck is a log? What is this log thing that's in this expression? So log is short for logarithm. And I'm not going to go into too much detail about what logs are, but for us, a very simple way of looking at this is going to be consider a log as something uh, to represent the power of 10. So a log represents the power of 10. Let's just run through a quick example of what this looks like with the pH of 7. So if I'm looking for the pH of the hydrogen ion concentration at pH 7, that's going to be the negative log of 1 times 10 to the negative 7th for the concentration of H+. Plus. I just said that the log represents a power of 10. So it's really looking for 10 to the something. It's looking for what's in the exponent, 10 raised to the something power. Well, the exponent in this example, or the power of 10, is negative 7. So the log takes this number, and instead I get negative, negative 7. Because the log of 1 times 10 to the negative 7th is just negative 7. It's taking this exponent out of the top of the power of 10. And then we can just evaluate this. A negative negative is simply a positive, so we get pH is equal to positive 7. And that's how they're connected. Now ultimately it's going to be easier to just kind of remember this relationship between the pH numbers and the H plus and the OH minus rather than worry about calculating logs. If you can get familiar with the relationships instead, it's much quicker to figure out these concentrations than using the equation. However, the equation is necessary if you have pHs that are not in whole numbers. Alright, so here we have a problem where the pH of a solution is 3.75. So automatically, we don't have a whole number. The question is asking, what is its hydrogen ion concentration? So I know the pH equals 3.75. And I want to know what my hydrogen ion concentration is. That means I'm going to have to start with the pH equation. pH equals the negative log of the hydrogen ion concentration. And now I can plug things in. I know 3.75. So 3.75 equals the negative log of what I'm missing, my H plus concentration. The next thing I want to do is not deal with a negative log, so I'm going to multiply both sides by negative 1, making this a positive, and making this a negative. So I just flip the signs. I multiply both sides by negative 1. So now I just need to undo this log concentration, because I want H plus by itself. So I need to get rid of the log of this concentration. And remember that a log is just looking for a power of 10. So what I can do is, I can raise both sides to the power of 10. I can do 10 to the negative 3.75 on the left side, and 10 to the log of the H plus concentration. Without getting into too much math here, raising a log as a power of 10 basically undoes both of these. So now my equation is 10 to the negative 3.75 equals my hydrogen ion concentration. Now I can't actually leave this number as a decimal. The power of 10 can't be decimal up here. So if you just type this into a calculator, it will return the value in proper scientific notation. So in this case, it's going to be 1.8 times 10 to the negative fourth molar as the concentration of hydrogen ions.